Jay. I don't want to. I know. Can Dad do it for me? I kind of did in the car, didn't I? Yeah, but he didn't answer. I put it on the wrong track. I put it on the track with the camera. John, do me a favor and switch it. Thank you. See all the cars, John? A lot of cars. I know. Too much, is high, too much yard. I know. Not enough buildings and scenery and streets and stuff. I like it. 
like your layout. It's this hobby shop. Yeah. Lots of cool buildings. I want to go back yeah, there on Saturday. Yeah. If I sit on this, I don't have to sit over there. You could break it. You could break it. It's not. You could break some blaming dad. So, so when we come out of here, we're going to go switch, and then we're going to go the same way, and then I think we should. Talk about good breaks. Who's 183 is this? Or right. 160? That was mine. I gave it to him. He gave it to John. Or he traded yeah. me the Amtrak for it. This one. The car? And, like, he gave me that, and I gave him the engine, this, oh, uh, that Santa Fe, mm. uh, and a few others, I know. The shell, the CP rail, oh. and a couple other, I think. The, uh, the, uh, what other ones? I don't know what other ones, but whatever. Gave me stuff for my grain train, like I need more grain cars. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, gosh, look at that. Who are all these people, Ben? You know Ben. He's the one who was kind of round that we met at the Isle Pacific. The one whose dad was driving everyone when we were at. Downtown, the Isle Pacific. Is that one at the Iowa Pacific? And that UPS E40 went, and I was pulling at it. Is it the one driving? Yeah, and he was kind of round. Yeah, eventually, Jenny, this is going to go and connect, and it'll make a you know you can run them in a circle. But you'll have to stay on this side because otherwise you'll have to duck underneath. Mm -hmm. Or well, we're going to just keep building on until it gets over there. But I, I think. Uh, make two straight modulars right here. Why? Because then you can, then I think it would be more practical for the way that, and then when you get down here, you go eight feet straight. We get to here. Where's that, where's that? Tape. I mean, we could still, we could still make these straight. It wouldn't be the end of the world, would it? Where's John going? Hey, there's a pair of them. A what? It's drying out. Oh, it's harder to cash. See, so then you get here. Where's the drove right? Huh? So you have to drill. What are you drilling, John? I know a restaurant I gotta go to again. Huh. That somebody brought up on uh, growing up in Oak Park, the Loon Cafe. We went there once. It's right by the Milwaukee Road. Is it still there? Yeah, it's still there. Is it open? Uh, probably. What's it on? Thatcher? What? We could drop right off on the Milwaukee Road. No, it's a different Milwaukee road. 
Yeah, but it'll get him to the North Concourse, so he has to do even less walking. So it's Northwestern. Uh, no, it's uh, the only North train North that it's the Chicago Northwestern tracks. The Milwaukee roads that go through Oak Park, right? No, just north of Oak Park. The one that goes to Elgin. Oh, oh, those tracks. Loon? Cafe? Yeah. characters to that uh, Junction uh, Depot thing in uh, Forest Park. Junction Diner. The one where the train... Oh, where the train... Yeah, oh. have you, there's one in Elmhurst. No, what town is that in, John? Uh, in Elmhurst or no? Like what? The The Splains. No, it's not the It's not the Splains one. Oh, it's, on, it's in Wheaton, maybe, right? Or is no. it West Chicago? Here he comes. Where is that gondola? Which one? screen is about that big. Ask Uncle Marge. She doesn't have any kids anymore. <laughs> Uncle John and Aunt Marge. Yeah, well, we were asking Uncle JJ if he'd buy it for Charlie, and we'll pay you back. Oh, would Mom love that, wouldn't she? Har, har, de har. Thank you, Aunt. No. up an intermodal train. Hardy har har. Are you gluing? No. Hardy har har. We're not going to have any room for wildlife on the layout. What but you do is take them over to Chanty. Okay. Ah, John! You put it too close. Or, uh, I know. I realize hey, Dad. that. Yeah. I'm not sure I want you to get me one. Okay. Because we have to pay in cash. It would be harder to get the one I want. And you wouldn't let me use it unless we go rail fan, and I don't want to go rail fan. I understand. Mark, what's the difference if you're sitting in the truck or if you're sitting on the couch? The couch is more comfortable. That's not bad. Square cars. And John isn't sitting right there just yelling about trains all the time. I could be yelling that we're not seeing trains in an angry tone, or I could be happy that we are seeing trains. 
could punch you in the face. I could punch you in the face too. I could sit on you. I could sit on you. I could sit on you. Ooh, let the bounce begin, huh, John? Oh. I could fart on you while I'm sitting on you. I could burp on you. Brown wants to take. I could burp on him. I could burp on him. If I can beat him, will you buy me? If I can beat that him, can I get a DS? Yeah. Dad, if I can beat John in a fight, can I get a DS? If you beat beat him in an arm wrestling, I'll I'll get you. Well, I can't. I gotta wait till I get my next paycheck. Every I always say that. I know that. And then you make it longer, and then you keep making it longer. Right, you always it. say that, and then I thought it. And then you get your paycheck. You don't get it for me. Then you say when I get my paycheck. Yeah. Keep doing that. Well, I'm gonna put this this week, but I might have to work more overtime. But that'll help pay for it. But John. I have to put all the crap together that I've been saving. And I think it'll John, <laughs> would you calm down? <laughs> I think it'll be enough. I don't want the ninety dollars. You don't want the one which one do you want? You want the three X XL? Yes. Of course you do. That's yes. the one to get, right, Greg? Yep. <laughs> it's not Christmas yet. It's almost my birthday. It's almost it was my it's birthday on my Wednesday. Birthday. You had a birthday last Wednesday? Yeah. Wow. Are you gonna now he is old enough to work for my birthday. Are you gonna buy Chucky for his birthday? Oh why is it? Uh, you know what I wanted were those atlases. Hey, Charlie, pick that up. Yeah. Money. That's, That's, That's my money. Well, why is it on the floor? Because oh, someone said it was on the couch and you moved it. It's bankable. Well, it's bending over. It's not worth anything. No, there was a quarter there. Was there a Yeah, there was. <laughs> what year was it? But golly, I was from when JJ graduated college. What? You should, you got a coin set from when you graduated college? 1842. Oh, the only thing. Well, Where does it say? We made uh, what is it? Uh, pennies from uh, 1900s. On one side it says Maryland, 1788. The old line say 2000. So. Were you, well, when were you, when did you become a Boy Scout? Come on, come on, chill. I was never a Boy Scout. You were a Cub Scout, right? I pushed it, I pushed it down in the I pushed it to Cub Scout in my life, and I was a fan. I never was a lot. And then I rejoined in, what, 78? I was a committee member for that Kenwood uh, community. Yeah, this is a bunny. True. A what? It's a real, it's a very real old cow that the guy was the I the still have my cow shirt. Oh, look at this car. It's perfect going over the bumpy track. Phototypical so Rock Island. I just two. Uh, wait, no, it's not phototypical Rock Island yet. You said you could run the train over there. I know. All right, yeah. Typical Rock Island. Never do rails. I think I saw it by Cub Scout Patches. That stars. Uh, I was a Cub Scout and then I was a Boy Scout and I quit. Oops. off the track. I didn't do it. Oh, I meant to tell you, I seen a train, the trailer train. The auto wreck? Yeah, right there. Or the, the oh, intermodal. It's all, it doesn't have any cars. Well, well, well. Road oh, well. It was on uh, the harbor running north at 95th Street. When? Coming home from work probably Friday. Why? No, it wasn't Friday. It was Thursday. Or Saturday. No, it was Saturday. It was moving too. Otherwise, I would have grabbed him. We'd have gone. But Caroline was here, so we could. Well, we could.
could have gone to eat, like, if it was sitting, we could have gone to, to the Gear, we could have gone to Palermo, then I think it would have been perfect. Gio Johnny's yeah. wasn't that good. No, I didn't think so either. It wasn't that good. The I'm wait trying to remember the name of the place I went to that was, um, it's in Rosemont. You ever go to uh, Rosewood or Rosebud or that fancy Rosebud? Rosebud? Fancy restaurant. Hey, you mean the Rosebud, the tavern one? Yeah, and it's yeah. like way overpriced. It's probably, it's, 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 yeah, but this is another location. It's near the convention center. Well, there's a oh, I know what you're talking I don't know the name of it, but I know what there's you're talking about. There's a pizza place right next door to it. Uh, and that's the one I want to see if I remember the name of that pizza but that pizza was pretty good. I thought it was geared down. That's where that space place I was by my farm was I want to go to the burger place by the racetrack. I think we'll just get on the Aurora train. I think I'll just do that. Yeah, Will your bike fit in the... We have to bungee it in the trunk of the square car. Is that okay? That's fine. How much does your bike cost? I mean, you and Charlie got it. You and Charlie got to sit in the back seat. Well, maybe we could put Charlie in the front seat. Yeah. That's gonna be real friendly, guys. Yeah. How's that? Well, well. Who's gonna sit in the middle in the back? Greg. That might be the way to go because then you guys will be separated. And Greg is the skinniest. No, I'm not. You're the skinniest. You're the skinniest, Johnny. I'm to drop Charlie yeah. off at uh, Paul Purdy's house. Okay. Yeah, that's an idea. <laughs> if, if he's not... If, but Paul Purdy is like the busiest 29-year-old I know. <laughs> he's always doing something. He never has time to lay around. For someone who doesn't go to school, who, has, who works at Jimmy John's, you would think he'd be like, laying around watching TV, playing video games all day long. He does know a lot about sports. He follows sports. Yeah, I could beat him in wrestling. You could? John, can you hook up your DC? See? Uh, yeah, we 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 come on, John. Dad, how long are we going to be until we leave? We, we, well, we should leave we pretty soon. What, what time is it now? Uh, I need three hours. 4.51. I'd say we can leave by 6. 5.30, 5 we got to leave. Because I got out. Oh, I'll, Craig, I'll, there's a train in like 10 minutes. I'll go see it. I'm yeah. allowing. Well, then when, if you go, when you come back, we leave. I'm allowing myself three hours to take him home, to come back, and to eat. And if we're going to LaGrange, that might even be more than three hours. Greg, how about we go see a Metra, and then come back, and then go? Or we could just hop in the car and go. Well, why don't you check the schedule on the queue? We already did. Well, what is it? Um, I think it's like what? Seven fourteen. Seven fourteen, and then like nine. That's a that would work. Seven fourteen. So or you we could seven fourteen into Bowen though. So seven o'clock into uh, uh, Lagrange. Let's just go now so we can have some real fan time. John, where'd you get a rash over there? Or I don't know what that is. Is that pimples? I don't know what it is. What's that noise? It's a DCC sound noise. Did you see that? Uh, did you see that uh, uh, NS switcher they had over there? Yeah. yeah. Did you like it? We should just go there and then Sunday. buy a locomotive on Saturday and then just run it on the light out. Because it's all 